Welcome to TechBeads, your go-to channel for the latest and greatest in tech. Today, we're diving into the future with 2023's most incredible inventions that are sure to change the world. From exoskeletons to ultrasound stickers, we've got it all covered. Make sure to subscribe to help us bring you even more exciting content in the future. Have you heard about the latest innovation coming out of Japan? The engineers there have once again demonstrated their ability to think outside the box with their latest creation, the Aerial Robot Dragon. Unlike traditional drones that are made bigger and more powerful to improve their performance, this robot dragon changes shape and flight to achieve its objectives. Developed by the JSK Lab team at the University of Tokyo, the robot dragon has been shown to carry weights of up to 2.2 pounds, move objects, and even turn valves. Its segments and propellers are designed to rotate, enabling it to curl into a ring or shape itself into a spiral. While this technology is still in development, the team's ultimate goal is to create a flying humanoid, something akin to an unmanned Iron Man. It's exciting to see such creative and innovative ideas coming out of the engineering world, and I can't wait to see what other breakthroughs will come out of Japan in the future. As a car enthusiast, I've been hearing about airless tires for years, but so far, most vehicles still use regular tires. However, I'm happy to report that Bridgestone has some exciting news, their airless tires are already in the final testing phase. In February of this year, they were spotted at an oil refinery in Chiba, Japan, where an electric minicar was wearing the new product. Bridgestone's airless tires are not just for cars, either, the company also has plans to market them to the truck industry. Trucks have a lot of issues with air and tire problems, which can cost a significant amount of money in downtime. Bridgestone's development is known to be retreadable and better able to withstand vibrations and shocks, and all the materials used are recyclable. Of course, Bridgestone has some stiff competition from the French company, Michelin, which has promised to start selling their airless tires in the next two years. It'll be interesting to see which company comes out on top in this race to create the best airless tire. The development of airless tires is a positive step forward in the tire industry. It's exciting to see the potential for tires that are more durable, better for the environment, and could save time and money on maintenance. However, I do wonder about the cost of these tires and how they'll perform in different weather and road conditions. Overall, though, I'm optimistic about the future of airless tires and eager to see how they develop in the coming years. Capra Robotics is a fascinating robot that's designed to carry heavy loads of up to 50 kilograms and can easily move around both smooth warehouse floors and rough terrain. It's capable of negotiating inclines of up to 17 degrees and 14 centimeter steps with ease, and can even accelerate up to 6 kilometers per hour. What's truly impressive is that it can operate for 17 and a half hours on a single charge, and in any weather, as long as it doesn't get colder than minus 20 degrees Celsius. The robot's platform is easily upgradable to serve different functions such as a janitor, security guard, or sprinkler. It's no surprise that Capra Robotics won the Robotics Company of the Year Award in 2022 and partnered with Deutsche Telekom, Europe's largest telecommunications company. I think Capra Robotics has a lot of potential to revolutionize the way we move heavy loads in different industries. The fact that it's capable of handling various terrains and can be used for different functions is impressive. However, the question remains, how affordable is it for companies to acquire this technology? This new drone called Riga has been designed to aid in the search for missing persons. One of the coolest features of this drone is its ability to detect cell phones, even in areas with no signal. With an accuracy of just a few meters, Riga can cover up to 16 square kilometers in just two hours, flying at speeds of up to 60 km per hour, and carrying up to 10 kg of payload. Thanks to advanced software, the drone can operate autonomously, meaning that it can carry out searches without constant input from operators on the ground. When the cameras pick up something of interest, the data is sent immediately to the operator on the ground. Riga is designed to operate in a wide range of temperatures, from minus 40 to plus 40 degrees Celsius, and can fly up to 3 km above sea level. 
In addition, it features a flam system, which is commonly used on airplanes, helping to avoid accidental collisions while in the air. In my opinion, Riga is a fantastic innovation that has the potential to save countless lives. Its ability to detect cell phones in areas with no signal is particularly impressive, and it's great to see advanced technology being used to help in the search for missing persons. The operating range and payload capacity are also impressive, allowing for efficient coverage of large areas. Overall, I think Riga has the potential to revolutionize search and rescue efforts, and I'm excited to see where this technology will go in the future. Now, let's talk about something really cool that happened in Australia. A group of engineering students put together the world's fastest solar-powered electric car, called the SunSwift 7. The car made an impressive 1,000-kilometer journey in just 11 hours, 53 minutes, and 32 seconds, which was confirmed by experts and later certified by the Guinness World Records. The team was led by Richard Hopkins, the former head of operations for the F1 team, Red Bull Racing. Hopkins explained that producing this car would be too expensive, so they had to remove many options for the sake of efficiency. However, the team has plans to enter the vehicle into the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge race, which involves driving 3,000 kilometers through the Australian outback. The SunSwift 7 is an incredible achievement, demonstrating the incredible potential of renewable energy. It's impressive to see what a group of dedicated engineering students can achieve when they set their minds to it. However, it's also important to remember that this car was designed with a specific purpose in mind, and that producing it on a larger scale would likely be prohibitively expensive. Nonetheless, I'm excited to see how this technology continues to develop in the future, and the potential for solar-powered cars to become a more common sight on our roads. Exoskeleton technology has come a long way since the 60s, and the Dutch team behind Project March is pushing the boundaries even further with their latest creation, the March 7 exoskeleton. This device is specifically designed to help people with musculoskeletal disorders, which affects a staggering 1.7 billion people worldwide, according to the WHO. One of the standout features of the March 7 exoskeleton is its waterproof and splash-resistant design, which makes it suitable for use in all weather conditions. It's also compatible with regular shoes, which makes it more convenient for users. Another interesting feature is its smartphone-controlled system and state-of-the-art computer vision, which allows the device to determine a safe route on its own. Overall, I think the March 7 exoskeleton is a promising development in the field of assistive technology. It has the potential to significantly improve the quality of life for people with musculoskeletal disorders, allowing them to move around more freely and independently. I'm excited to see how this technology will continue to evolve and help those in need. The Institute has come up with yet another fascinating development, a sticker that performs ultrasound on internal organs. It's incredible to see how the future is slowly becoming a reality, and if these stickers become widely available, doctors and patients alike will be able to monitor the condition of their organs and implants in real time from their smartphones. The sticker is about the same size as a stamp, and it can be worn for approximately 48 hours without any discomfort while walking or doing sports. The sticker is made up of a standard hydrogel, a membrane to hold it in place, and a sensor. In the future, patients will be able to apply the stickers themselves and upload the data to the system, where it will be analyzed by an AI system. This means that people will be able to detect any problems from the comfort of their own homes and receive immediate attention if necessary. This is an incredible technological advancement that has the potential to revolutionize healthcare, and I can't wait to see how it develops in the coming years. The University of California San Diego specialists are developing a fascinating health monitoring patch with unique features. Unlike other health monitoring devices, this wearable device tracks several parameters such as blood pressure, heart rate, glucose, caffeine, and alcohol levels. This revolutionary device aims to help individuals monitor their health and detect any changes in their body in real time. With the ongoing pandemic and isolation measures, people may not be able to visit a doctor as frequently, making this device an ideal solution to stay on top of their health. 
Furthermore, the research team plans to create more advanced patches with additional sensors to record biomarkers of different diseases. This technology has the potential to transform the healthcare industry by providing a more efficient and cost-effective way to monitor and manage patients' health. Japan has come up with a new innovation. Honda engineers have developed a hands-free wheelchair that can be controlled by leaning in the desired direction. This is made possible by a posture sensor that accurately detects movements and the Omni Traction Drive system that allows for free movement in a 360-degree range and easily overcomes road irregularities. The wheelchair is still in development, so it's unclear when it will be available for purchase or if it will be available at all. It's exciting to see such advancements being made in the mobility industry, and it's especially heartening to see Honda's commitment to making mobility more accessible to everyone. Throughout the years, broken bones have traditionally been treated with the use of casts, which can cause a great deal of discomfort for the patient. It's common for individuals to feel frustrated, unable to scratch or alleviate the itching sensation of the affected area. But, why suffer when there's a newer and more innovative option available, the XSplit product, which utilizes 3D printing technology? This product offers a lighter, more convenient and practical solution to the traditional solid cast. What's more, it's customized to fit each individual patient's needs. According to American surgeons, there is another advantage to using the XSplit product, as it allows healthcare providers to easily monitor the condition of the skin surrounding the injury. However, it's important to note that this modern solution comes with a hefty price tag, ranging from $200 to $500. In my opinion, while the XSplit product is undoubtedly an innovative solution to an age-old problem, a high cost might be a barrier for some people. It's important to consider whether the benefits of using this product outweigh the financial cost. Ultimately, it's up to each individual to decide whether they're willing to pay for this new technology or stick to the traditional route of using a cast.